All right, I think we're all right. I think we are good to go. Yeah, I think we're good to go. All right, so we are doing our sub battle, you guys. 960 chess. So um, I've never played 960. I hope I don't disappoint our sensei. Bill, again, if you've never played before, but the, the one thing I would say is the basic principles apply. Try to play for center with your pawns as much as you can. You and pieces. And right, pieces. right. No, but I mean, like, I think that's the one thing that still is very traditionally true is you got to play for the center. Yeah, play for the center. Uh, one piece, And then remember, guys, that castling, you got to find uh -huh. where your rooks are and then where your king and rook are supposed to end up normally. And then you're supposed to... Uh, you're supposed to go go like that. All right, let me follow my guy. Yeah, I followed my first two dudes. Oh, they're. Oh, my my guy's in a game. Van de Bombo needs to finish his game. <laughs> okay. e e All right. So be it. He's uh he's I'm watching his game right now, Van de Bombo. He's about to get mated. Mm -hmm. Um, that's good. I mean, he he's he's okay. He, there's maiden one on the board. His opponent missed it. Mm -hmm. It's it's now it's mate in. It's not mate anymore. He's fighting. <laughs> He's doing his best. Right, right. Okay. Well, um, is he done? Nope. <laughs> no. Okay. No. Okay. I thought you said check me out. He's board. made it again. Made it. Made it. Just made him. Made him on the board. Oh my god! This guy missed the Hikaru. This, I'm watching. A, oh, it's mate. It's finally mate. All right, Vandabumbo, don't play another game. Mm -hmm. Don't play another yes. game. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Please stop. Stop. Okay. Good. He stopped, and it's game time. It's game time, indeed. Here we go. So what's the eval? Plus three point three six. So pretty standard. Actually, wait. Is this? No, this isn't what I had against Gary yesterday, but it's kind of close. No, not Gary. Sorry, against Fabiano, I mean. Kind of close. Yeah. With the queen yeah. and two bishops like this. What? Dude, it's 960 chess. You can't abort. Oh, yeah. Doesn't that mean the the starting... Does the starting setup... Oh, it's going to change because he aborted. Very wrong. Very wrong. Very wrong. Very inappropriate. You're not supposed to abort like that. Oh, my God. Guys, come on. Don't... What did... We, we have, like, a... Oh, yeah, and it totally switched up. <laughs> yeah, now it's a different... <laughs> he didn't like it. So, guys, if you don't like the starting setup... <laughs> Just abort it, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. This man got around it. Unbelievable. Okay, but okay. Pretty, pretty normal, I would say. Pretty normal. I, I, is knight... I don't, I don't like no, knight... No, I, I don't like that either. I think I think it's bringing the knight up. That's a little bit excessive. Hikaru, it's a London... <laughs> London. Yeah, so you're gonna go knight b3 and it's a lot. Oh. Yeah, but your bishop, you don't have space to create. I mean, your bishop can only come back to the edge, so it's not quite the same. Well, now he's gonna a, go e3 at some point. This is a Nimso versus a London. Amazing. This guy's trying to mirror their own openings. <gasps> <laughs> I'm just gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna draw. Mm -hmm. The. <laughs> well, these guys are very confidently blitzing at their moves. Yeah, oh. I mean, Blackman's bishop takes a2, which was winning the rook on g1, because he couldn't castle there. Bishop a2 just won an exchange. Well, I wasn't going to say anything, because there's a chance something else happens. Oh, oh I see. Okay, well, nah, now it's too odd. Good move by Black. Oh, he stopped it. That's actually, oddly enough, I think that's a great move because now you can activate the knight via another square. I think that's actually a very, very good move, playing g3. And somehow, isn't the bishop on b4 really well placed now? It's great, yeah. Yeah, that's b3 a th is a fantastic move. Two stops knight c4. Now the bishop is very secure on the diagonal. It's going to be an interesting game. And also remember, guys, it is, uh, it's three minute, so you need to move. You mm -hmm. gotta go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Very, very true. Agreed. Do you have an eval bar for chess 960 from the yeah, beginning? Yeah, I do. Yeah, it's a oh. zeros. Yeah. Wow. Okay. C4. I like White's position. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I agree. I think, I think White's doing, um, White's doing really well with the bishops. I mean, it's turned into a good, uh, good London. Very, very good London. 
both of these guys are 1700 rated in in blitz so it's important to remember that you know, the rating oh queen h5 is really annoying you sure about that levy i th i think at this level yes okay <laughs> i think well, at this we'll level see. yes we'll see we'll see I mean, <laughs> there's there's ways to get you know okay that's a good move yeah that's a good move yeah that's a very good move yeah, I mean, without knight f6, I would have agreed. But with knight f6, at least there's no real, like, checkmate idea anymore with the diagonal. Oh, and with that move, your knight on h1 is very sad. Yeah, that's the one danger in 960 is if you're not careful, you can end up with a piece that's just, like, kind of out of the game. Like, this knight on h1 is really out of the game. It has no no squares to come into. I don't know if you uh, looked at, at the games yesterday of mm -hmm. everything in, in, uh, in, in the champion showdown, but in the final round, Magnus beat Ali Reza, and Ali Reza didn't move his queen from h1 for 35 moves, <laughs> which is that's really bad, right? Like, you won't win if that happens, so... Most of the time. Not always, but most of the time. Yeah, was, that's true. Yeah, I, I mean, I just, like, it's one of those things where, like, in between, I don't really want to look close. I just would rather chill and play Minesweeper. And then, like, after the event ends, like, I stream a little bit, but I'm pretty tired and exhausted, so then I don't end up looking at the game. Because there's actually no relevance whatsoever. Yeah. Although, I was, I was I, my, my second told me that I should look at the game between Maxime and Ali Reza, because apparently mm -hmm. Maxime found a very impressive way to lose or something. from like. Oh, yeah, position. he lost, like, in one move. Like, it was just, oh, okay. like, again. Okay, yeah. Yeah. But, um, yeah. Yeah. And, no, it's just, I, 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 he said, he's like, when you have a chance, make sure to check out the way Maxime lost to uh, Ali Rez. It was, it was something else. So, um, so I didn't get a chance to look, but, but yeah. Cool. A question that Anna and I were having, we were joking about this. Can you see other games while you're playing? I mean, n I think that you probably could go on to Lee Chess and find it, but no. Basically, the way it works is you get the position in your inbox and then you automatically click the game and it opens um so that's how okay. we're doing it it's like it's it's auto set okay Ooh, what was that what was that though that was i don't know man I, that was a weird move black's also got 20 seconds by the way mm -hmm. also true oh man just move dude just move you're up 30 seconds no fear just move no fear was 94 pre-move didn't that take like 0. 0.1 seconds I, th I think so, but he's only got 15 seconds. He's got to go. Oh, man. Oh, queen trade's not going to win you the game. Maybe. Come well, on, maybe you got to go. Go. Know. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, keep going. Keep thinking, man. Keep thinking. No rush. Keep thinking. That's good. That's good. You got to think, man. Don't hang pause on E7. Got to think. <sighs> he's, about, he's about to get mated. He did just yeah. get mated in the bullet game he played. Oh, no mate now. Yeah, and, I, mean, I, I don't know. Yeah, I think it's just too much time at this level. Don't, yeah, okay, don't blunder. Just keep a deep breath. Good. Oh. Yeah, three seconds is not, oh, but he's moving really fast. Oh, never mind. That was, that took go. a very long time. No, why did he take? Plaque, plaque, plaque. Oh, <laughs> oh my god that got really close actually like van de bumbo actually moved really fast there he should have been able to draw that yeah I, I i don't know that was that was weird my guy uh played very well but at the same time mm -hmm. super slow in the middle uh, yeah we take, we take that l it's not a not the worst thing in the world but now we have to win let's go luke honey let's go jai 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 ho let's go Hikaru, this is a matchup between England and the United Kingdom. <laughs> so it's a match between like a Brexiter and a Remain, Remainer or something, basically. Something like that. Yeah, yeah. guys, very. Uh, oh my. Oh man, F three is a weird move. Yeah. There's been some weird openings in this in this nine sixty event. Mm hmm. Yeah, I mean, I think normally what I would say is I like positions that are more unorthodox. So, like, positions where you have bishops, like, in the corner or castling is very quick, like this one. I, they always concern me because I want something where there's their dynamics. So, I don't want something where it can turn into, like, symmetrical and be very dry. Um, and, like, this sort of position, I think, lends itself to more of that. 
because the bishops are in the corner, so obviously you're going to fianchito them both ways. Mm -hmm. But then secondly, you just move a knight and castle very early. So I feel like the, the, the possibilities at the start are far more reduced because of the piece placement, like in this setup. So I really don't like setups where you have bishops like on very obvious squares where you have to open the diagonal immediately, because then it becomes symmetrical. And then third, if the king can castle right away, that also bugs me. Well, white is playing this in a passive and very solid way. So black can basically just free reign... Mm -hmm. take as, as many squares as possible yeah, yeah you're right though like mm -hmm. bishop b7 bishop g7 and then like some sort of castling and the position becomes pretty standard pretty fast right which is what i really don't like I, i've never liked that in 960 that's always bugged me knight fd2 yeah both players okay. are playing pretty well although i white actually has misplayed it because he put the knight on b3, so the bishop is dead. It's like just you just have this pawn in front of the bishop, and you've got the knight, which stops the pawn from moving. Mm -hmm. This is actually really bad for white. Uh, also, white is not rated 1,100, guys. White's mm -hmm. actual blitz rating is 1,650. He but just... that means he's played a lot less of 960, or is this a variant rating? I think, no, I think it's a variant rating. Or I don't know, he could be just be terrible at 960. <laughs> true, true, yeah. I guess it's possible. But yeah, see, like, the, this is a thing. Like, in this one, black is better, but it's very quickly turned into something that's, like, just normal. It's just very normal looking. Yeah, but black is doing pretty well here. Black is much better, objectively. But we'll see what happens. 95, I like. Oh, the guy put all his pawns on light squares and traded his dark squared bishop. Mm-hmm. Whoa, whoa. That's, That's a good or... shaky move. Black's still probably much better because of the white bishop on h1 objectively behind the pawns. And black has the open diagonal. But I still don't love it. Okay, that's good. Okay, doesn't blunder. Yeah, because with the bishop behind the pawns, black is better. Although queen b2 is a great move. I like queen b2. Okay. Rook mm -hmm. d1. Mm-hmm. I'm loving e5. Now this game, your guy is playing way too slowly. No, he's playing good. He's winning. No, 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 no. Now the bishop gets blocked out. Okay, that's, <laughs> that's a good, good, good. Keep it real. Keep it real. Let's go. Let's go. We got this. Oh my god. Oh, nice move. Terrible move. What are you talking about, Levy? It's a great move. Trade the queens. Oh my. Look at this guy zigzagging. My god. Yeah, it's like it's like a snake or something. Speaking of which, Levy, do you, do you Oh, I guess you're in New York, so snakes don't exist, right? Well, we got Kevin Durant now, but other than that, no. <laughs> okay. Okay, Levy. Um, all right. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> oh, all right. There's the, there it is. There it is. That's the line of the day. That's the line of the day. That's going to go in the, uh, <laughs> going to go in the video. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Right. <laughs> But yeah, it's like, so I'm like, I mean, it's like, uh, it's just like, I've been seeing snakes everywhere lately. So it's just, you know, a bit, the zigzag remind me of that. It, hopefully outside of your house. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no I mean, obviously. Okay. Ob <laughs> I mean, obviously. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, in, uh, when I grew up in New Jersey, I, uh, we had garden snakes, but I never, uh -huh. I never saw anything, you know, anything. Yeah, yeah. Egregious. Yeah, I think I've seen like two or three rattlesnakes since I came out here. It's like not that bad though. Not that bad. Let's go trade the queens. Fast. Make a draw. Just a draw is a good decision. White's 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 gonna lose otherwise. <gasps> what was that? Oh my god. No oh my yeah, you okay, didn't okay, see it. Queen e two was a terrible move. Okay. Come on. Nice. No, don't trade. Yeah, it's now now white's gonna lose. Oh my god. Oy, oy, oy. Take it all. Take it all. There's a rook hanging. No, oh my he god. See it. It's fine. It's just he makes a draw. <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> nice. Okay. 
Oh, he's gonna like lose his queen somehow. Mm -hmm. Oh no, don't repeat. Good. Block. By the way, Levy, it's crazy how um how like the time matters. Like when someone's up by like three seconds, you can't pick it up, I've noticed at this level. It's just not possible. Uh uh, are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? Oh my god. Was... If if Black had played one check, he would have won there. If he played one check on A2, he would have won. Yeah, white just like stall. That was so terrifying. Oh my god. Ah <sighs> Stop stressing me out, people. But what I was saying is that, like, generally, it seems like when you're down, when they get inside 10 seconds, someone's up like two or three seconds, unless there are like 20 obvious checks, you can't come back, which I always find interesting. It's just because it, I mean, I feel like it's it, it's a little bit different where I'm at sometimes. I don't know if that makes sense. Are you still there? Yeah, Lenny? it does make sense. I think, I think, I just it's like it seems like it never, it literally never, they can't come back. They just lose on time every single time. Mm hmm. What even even just now, my guy was down like 15 to 40, and he picked it up, but he still was unable to do anything with it. Mm -hmm. Right, right. All right, next game. Wait, I can't follow? Wait, what? Is Fai's chess 87? Fai's not... chess 87, you got to be in live chess, my man. You got to be in live chess. We're waiting on Yo, you. We're waiting Fai on you. is. What the? Can't can't swear, because I'm, I'm on a Zoom call right now. Zoom has a very strict anti-swearing policy, but <laughs> okay. get into live chess, people. Let's go. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I think both of my next two guys are not in there. So, Faisha, you got to be in live chess, and Larry David look alike. You also need to be in live chess. Um, Faiz, you you need to be you need to be in live chess. No, you guys, Zoom does not have that. That that's Levy just joking. That's just Levy joking. Yeah, I'm sorry. I sometimes say things that are not true very seriously, and it, people aren't like, Wait, yeah, no, that doesn't make any sense. Yeah, no, Zoom does not actually have that. Yeah, now of course because I turn my fan on, everyone's just writing in coggers. I can't. You where, your fan Fai, on? Fai's, dude, where are you? Yeah, I turn my fan on. Yeah. I mean, if anything, we can skip him and then replace him. Yeah, but the problem is Larry David isn't in live chess either, is he? Oh no, he is. He is. Larry David lookalike is in live chess. Okay, so so yeah. Okay, let's let's go. <laughs> all right, let's get going. Uh, all right. Okay, Larry Larry David is in live chess. So I guess yeah, we were. Or, or are we are we gonna are we gonna is the other guy gonna substitute and play first? Sure, I'm I'm good with whatever. I'm following both dudes. Proper Gandalf, great yeah, name. Yeah, we, we, I'm following both of them. So it's you guys decide who you want to play first. I mean, I feel like Larry should probably play first because since the other guy to get subbed out, it makes more sense. But okay, we'll go with Proper Gandalf first, or not. Okay, whatever. It's all good. Okay. I am happy to to follow any game. Okay, so what is what is the setup? Queen Rook, King Rook, King Bishop Rook. Queen, two knights, and a juicer. Um, this looks actually kind of interesting. Probably it's going to be a lot in the center. I like g3 to peon, peon, cheeto, the bishop at the start. Can I... I'm going to tell you something right now. Mm -hmm. I played Larry David lookalike earlier. We had a 960 arena. He blundered his queen mm -hmm. on move two. Okay. And so I spent the game like talking to chat, playing. And then at some point I did like a four or five move pre-move combination and I took my hands off the mouse. Mm -hmm. And either he's a genius or he just saw my pre-moves. He sniped, yeah, he totally sniped. <laughs> and he sniped my pre-moves, won all my pieces and I lost. <laughs> so I lost to a 1500 with queen odds is basically the, yeah. So, and then he came to your team. So that, mm. this guy's really, he's really out to get me today. Yeah. And more drop, no, it's Fianchito. I mean, that's how you pronounce it when you open up a diagonal for the bishop. <laughs> Caro, I've um, been saying and peasant in my recap videos, and yeah. people get really mad at me on YouTube because they don't know that like we say it as a joke. So people are like, I think you're mispronouncing it, actually. Yeah, I think it's... <laughs> and then people like get into this big debate in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> People think I'm a dumbass. <laughs> right. Well, I mean, we are American, so it's pretty, pretty standard thinking. Um, there is that. But yeah. 
This is very suspicious play by Vladimir Nine. And by yeah, the way, what happened to the other that. Vladimirs? Like, what, what is this guy the? I was wondering if there's some way for Black to make a checkmate here, but I don't see it. Yeah, I don't see it. You see what I was thinking, right, Levy? Uh, yeah. There's 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 no good square to do it. There's no no good square to make a checkmate. Well, let's put it this way: not to make a checkmate correctly. Yeah. Right. Exactly. Yeah. But. Yeah. We, you know. True. If, if it gets spotted, it will get spotted. Let's yeah. See. No, but I mean, to be joking aside, though, I mean, we 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 of course we've spent our whole lives playing chess, so we know how to pronounce things. It's not we're not intentionally uh, uh stupid, shall we say? Most of us can't speak for <laughs> can't speak for can't speak for all Americans. <laughs> okay. <Love you. laughs> um but yeah okay anyway yeah i'm gonna look up whether okay let's see chess.com forward slash member vladimir <laughs> taken last login 2010 vladimir 2 exists vladimir 3 exists mm -hmm. vladimir 4 also exists mm -hmm. vladimir 5 also exists mm-hmm Wait, you know what's something crazy about Vladimir 5? He made his account in 2005? Uh, uh-huh. And, no, 2009, sorry. And he logged in, like, last week. So, that's dedication. Jeez, 15 years. That's crazy. Oh, my God. What is Queen E4? Oh, no. Uh, this guy actually is Vladimir 9 because all the other Vladimirs were taken. Mm -hmm. And if he's worth his name, he will find the best move here. Right, this is true. No, but he's not from Russia. He's from Czech Republic. So, not going to happen. Fake Vladimir. Yeah, not the real one. Also, Larry David, you've got to go to live chess. I don't know why y'all signing up, but then, the, oh, and he finds the move. Yeah, White's doing some weird stuff here. All the pawns on the dark squares. King mm -hmm. is on the light square diagonal. Yeah. No, but Larry David was in live chess a little while ago. So, I don't, I don't know what happened. Or I was able to follow him, which I thought meant he was in live chess. He he went for a smoke break. He couldn't stand mm -hmm. the stress. Chess is very stressful. I'm not gonna lie. Are you still tilted by the Linier game? Well, no, no, I wouldn't say I'm tilted. I'm just very disappointed because that, that's a half point that I just have this feeling that extra half point might cost me the chance to win the event. Tilted is the wrong word. I'm just I'm still annoyed because I feel like that's a half point that um, that I should have had. But mind it's... you, I probably shouldn't have beaten Gary. So maybe it all evens out at the end of the day. That's fair. I felt like I felt like yesterday, with the exception maybe of like the like the first ten moves against Gary, the play was pretty smooth. Like mm -hmm. Fabian, I forgot to ask you about this, but I also we don't want to ask you like a hundred questions. Fabiano's whole plan of Queen B five, what was that? Seemed really odd. Or... I think there was Fabiano. I think there were a couple things. I think either like either Fabiano felt really bad after the game against. I think I think there's a good chance Fabiano felt really bad after the game against Gary because he certainly should not have won that game. Um, so I think okay. either Fabiano felt really bad because of that game, or it was just like, I don't know, he just, he just wanted to move quickly and not think. That's what I would say. One of those two things had to have been the case, because the way that he played it was just, he played, he played that game against me like he had just lost a terrible game. Like, he was on tilt, is the way it felt to me. Um, it, it was really strange. We were perplexed by the queen move, and then all of a yeah. sudden he was just totally busted, so I... I don't yeah, kind of came out of nowhere. Uh, are neither of these dudes castling? Do they know how to castle? Maybe not. But yeah, that that was my that was that's what I felt like. Is I felt like e Fabiano was like either he just felt really bad after beating Gary, or he just didn't want to think and he moved quickly. I don't think castle was a good move by Black. Ironically, no, no. it wasn't. Just because we say it doesn't mean that you guys have to do it. Also, stop <laughs> listening to the stream. <laughs> Okay, come on, dude. Four seconds. Let's go. Move. Move. Come on. Stop thinking. You got to move. One. Just move. You got to just move. Just move. Just move. Just move. Take the pawn. Not that one. Just move. Okay, good. Okay. Good. Very, very good. Okay. Well, subs, we've had good positions. We just lost two games on time. So. That's true. Yeah, if you lose on time, then it's, then it's all good. Oh, next game already is done. There's Larry. 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 Vladimir 9. You gotta love it. Oh, whoops. 
I wonder how many Vlad Vladimir's there are. Like 10? 11? Probably 20. Yeah, no, you guys, we got the 3 is not easy. Obviously, 3 is very hard. Um... You know, actually, Levy, I was curious. For Pog Champs, did you think that was fair to have them have to play 3 0? I was kind of curious as sort of the tiebreaker. Um. Because mm, I did not think so. I, I didn't think it was right. Because I felt like too many of the players, that they're, they're so new and they're just getting into the mm -hmm. game that I actually thought it was really brutal on, on them. Like, because it just felt like if you got down on time, you just lost no matter what. Yeah, yeah. Also, going from 10 5 to 3 0 is just odd. In general, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wasn't, so I, I don't know. Yeah, I wasn't thrilled about it. Yeah, it just it felt really hard. Like I, I like Thor, for example. Like I mean, he just ended up down on time against TF Blade, and that was just it. Period. Um, yeah. But yeah. By the way, you guys who are looking at the ratings, it means that on the sheet that is their Blitz rating, and in 960 or variants are higher rated. That's why the ratings are different. The ratings on the sheets are, or sorry, are um are different. Sorry. No, uh, the problem is I see sheet or sheets, and I just I think about it the other day, and then secondly I started watching the show because because uh, someone recommended it to me the other day, um, and so I've been watching this show called uh, pardon my French, but it's called Shits Creek. Um, so so I've just, it's a great uh, name. Yeah. I mean, those guys knew what they were doing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Of course. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, <laughs> let's keep watching. Um, yeah. Um. Was there a hanging bishop somewhere? I didn't see a hanging bishop. Maybe there was. Yeah, I, I looked away. I had to write a message. And uh -huh. I look away. I come back. These guys are like 30 moves in. Yeah. Uh, so I, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, so... so Oh, there was hanging bishop on b4. Okay, I actually didn't see it. But anyway. Um, c5 I like. I think that's a good move. Oh, no, it's actually not a good move. It's a bad move. <laughs> <laughs> But anyway, yeah, sorry. No, it's just, so that's been on my mind because I've been binging that because uh, the girl I think recommended it to me the other day and so I started binging it. White just got so lucky he didn't mm -hmm. play queen takes c6, rook takes d1. Whoa, thank you Omo Lord for the 10 gifted. Thanks so much, man. I appreciate it. Thank you for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you. Omo um, was on a, on a roll. I think he yeah. gifted 10 here earlier too. Uh, right, so what were you starting to say, Levy? A uh, couple moves back. Uh, white missed queen takes c6, but if he had played that, he would have ran into rook takes d1. Right, so. with the yeah, with the checkmate, yeah, yeah. Oh, apparently, so. Omo gave 10 to you and 10 to Eric Rose, and before he gave 10 to me, so I, I, I mean, I feel I don't know, I don't feel I feel like I'm what am I, I'm the sloppy thirds or something. <laughs> like, <laughs> I, I think, I think he's just making the rounds. I think like Eric was stream. I woke up and Eric was streaming, Eric was streaming at like 6 a.m. Eastern. Uh huh. Uh, okay. Then, yeah. then he came here, and then you know he's going around. Yeah. After this, he's gonna go where? Where's he gonna go next? Wow, Rook C8 is a great move. Or Hikaru, he saved the best for last. There you go. True. True. Yeah. <laughs> oh, actually, sorry, he did give me five earlier. I forgot. Yeah, he gets me five and then ten. But joking aside, oh. thank you so much, Omo. <laughs> I'm actually joking. Like, is that a good move or a bad move? Is that a good move or is that a terrible move? I'm trying to figure out. Because with the correct play, this is... Actually, no, it's just a draw, isn't it? I, at this level, this is anything but a draw. Maybe. Both sides can lose. Yeah, I think the best idea here is really, really hard to find for black. Yeah. Rook c6, rook takes g6 is winning. He missed it, though. Yeah. Bum. But it's still going to be hard. Anyway, yeah, Omo, it's all good. I'm, I'm making a joke. No worries, dude. It's all good. Yeah, White's going to win here. Unbelievable. Pat Frapp was talking some trash. He was like, I'm going to get I'm gonna get back uh, Larry David for beating you. What is Black doing, by the way? Black's just not Well, what stopping. is White doing? Oh, my God. What is Rook B2? Yeah, there's an H pun, Larry. How did I lose to Larry? I mean, my God. Because you're just not very good at chess, Levy? I, I, I guess but so. I mean, I don't know how this guy saw a five move pre-move sequence and sniped it and didn't let it happen like that to me is crazy this man just let a pawn just go he didn't even stop the, oh man crazy all right oh, anyway two, so two, 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 two. pretty pretty good start all right let's go oh i'm trying I'm, try I'm typing follow in twitch chat genius mm -hmm. all right peter come on oh it's oh my gosh it's peter versus jojo oh 
there's something special about that? Uh, well, no. Oh, it's Peter but... Lecko. Oh, I, or it's... Leader Pecko. Okay. Yes, <laughs> okay. It's, it's Peter Lecko versus the 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 backup thumbnail god, right. aka Jojo. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. Jojo versus Lecko. Are they not both in live chess? They're playing. Oh, I, I don't. Wait, what? I thought I was following him. Jojo chess noob. What? Oh, I followed him and then I hit the X and I guess it unfollowed. Okay, that's weird. All right. Um, what do we have here? Pretty standard bishops, king, queen, rook, knight. Pretty standard, I would say. Yeah, but these guys are playing well. These guys are playing better than most of the people playing so far. Mm hmm. True. Okay, so let's see. Did you see what happened at the U.S. Open? Between, you mean Novak? Yeah, the Novak. Yeah, thing. he totally should have been DQ'd, though. I mean, I'm sorry that's a hot take, but of course he should be DQ'd, hundred percent. I, I don't. I I think it's a hotter take to say that it was an accident and he shouldn't have been DQ'd. I think. I well, think I mean, it, it was a hundred percent an accident. Like, there's no doubt about. Yeah, that, yeah, that obviously. <laughs> um, but like the thing is, you can't really like the the problem with that is that if you don't DQ him, then you have to go back to like the incidents last year with Serena Williams, for example, and then it's like, well, wait, there's a double standard. So I think, I mean. I think to be fair, you have to make that ruling. Yeah, I don't think it was that it was that crazy. But what a yeah, what a what a wild. But I mean, day. I mean, and now here's a hot take because this is a hot take. I would say, but like what what I would say in regards to that is that um is that it kind of proves the point that as far as like Serena goes, there was no double standard. They the the judge, I think it was Jorge Ramos, was just following the rules um, when he made his decision. You mean the last U.S. Open? Yeah, when when um when there were the issues with Serena and Naomi Osaka, mm -hmm. when um when Serena, I think she first she defaulted a point, then it was a game, um right. and, and yeah, and so like they they were trying to say, well, there's double standard, and what she, you know, like it's just you know it's because she's a woman or or, or whatever. Like I, I don't I don't want to get into it close that much, but what I would say is it proves the point that the rules are the rules and they're applied regardless. So yeah. There you guys go. There's my take for the day. You're very quiet, Levy. Uh, who, uh, I, I don't know enough about tennis. I, I, I remember that that happened, but as far as the fallout or anything, the only sport that I really, I, I follow two sports closely. It's mixed martial arts and basketball. And okay. Okay. Yeah. Everything else is, yeah. you know, and chess, of course, mm -hmm. chess, my favorite sport. Yeah. So, I mean, I, I follow tennis very closely, so that's why I'm familiar with it. Um, but, yeah, Tim Henman was default for a very similar thing at Wimbledon and doubles when he hit a ball girl. Yeah, it makes sense. I mean, no, I mean, I, I think it was completely the right thing to do. And if they hadn't done it, then there would be very big arguments um, about double standards for sure. Because what he did, even if it was an accident, it still was wrong. Like, it, it was just wrong. So, so I mean, I think... Um, My guy is getting destroyed. obliterated. Yeah. Yeah. Or is he? Wait. He is. But That's will the nice guy find move, the right though. move or not? Will JoJo find the right move? That's the big question. Sport, it's a it's a something board game. Yeah, but 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 okay then then what is like uh, I mean video games are called esports so that that's why I would say like in the general terms of things, um, chess definitely falls in that category too. Oh no, I. I... That, that was one that, that you could chalk that up to me just saying something seriously. But I, when people ask me if I consider chess a sport, I say no. But at the same time, I follow that up with like, you need to be in like good shape to mm -hmm. have longevity. And now, play ironically, well. this piece hang is actually really good for white if he sees this tactic. But I don't think he'll see it. Wrong one. The other one was winning, Levy, wasn't it? Knight g4, queen f4, bishop e3, queen f5 was winning. Here, 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 here with the fork of the king and the queen, and you win the game. But he went to the wrong square by going to well, f5. Well, he saw knight f5 hitting g7 and the queen, but he didn't look what his opponent could do, and I right. think he, he just missed the check, and yeah. now he's, he's And busted. now it's minus eight. Yeah, exactly. But it's blitz. You got to move, Jojo. Just move, dude. So, yeah, Hikaru found a way to box in the queen. I think knight d5 was also maybe winning, too. I think that also Probably, the queen. Any move that doesn't allow, but still, like this is not. Oh uh, well, it, no, it's yeah, it's bad. That's, that's tricky. Just keep thinking, man. Your queen's under attack. You got to keep thinking. Come on, Jojo, move. 
Just move, dude. Just move. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Come on, Jojo. You got this, he, man. He he don't he don't see it. He don't see he just... it. Not even now. He don't see it. Oh okay, no. Keep moving, keep moving. It's still a game. It's still a game. Well, Jojo's okay. down a lot and down on time. I don't know how much of a game it is, but he's he's only got one thing to go for. Yeah. Uh, don't flag, buddy. Yeah, unfortunately. Yeah, just too much to ask for. Yeah, it's just too slow. By the way, Levy, here's a question. Someone in my chat said chess should have been an eSport years ago when eSports started to be a thing. Do you agree with that? When did eSports start to be a thing, though? That's an important question. I would say probably in the last deck. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, bl Black won by resignation. I thought Black resigned. Yeah, I was so like, did what? I at first, yeah. No, but I, I would say probably in the last decade or so it became really popular, right? Maybe the last five years, but definitely the last ten, I would say. Uh, so I feel like yeah. chess, chess was there at the start of the internet dawn. Really, it, it was like you had like the internet chess club. You had a lot of different chess sites that um that, that popped up um mm -hmm. in like the early '90s, mid '90s, and then even into the 2000s. Um, so so I, I think like, I mean, do you do you think that chess should have been a part of that or not? I think I, I, I let's put it this way. I don't see why not. Um, okay. Because so, mm -hmm. when you look at some of the rosters of, of these teams that, that have like these esports, you got like a few guys that are great on camera, really personable, charismatic, like giving the interviews. Some of these guys are just like, they're just as, you know, uh, maybe introverted and like uh, focused on just the game, like chess players. Like chess players are mm -hmm. historically not so great at giving this crazy interview where it's like, ah, exciting and everything. So. I don't mm -hmm. see why not. Like, mm -hmm. but having said that, we've chess has never been good at attracting. So, so then, if if you if you say that it should have been a part of it, what do you think the do you think the reasoning is the personalities? Do you think it's like the governing bodies? Like, do you think it's like the business people? The business people? Like, what what do you think is the main reason it didn't um didn't didn't become big? Or well, here's something. Sports. Well, here's something that I don't I don't quite understand from a conceptual standpoint. So, mm -hmm. who who makes a league and who, and where did these orgs come from and where do they recruit the players? Like, how did that start? How did league become a giant esport? Do you know? Cause I don't know. No, I, I don't, don't actually, I don't know. Um, so, but, but then again, guys, like league is the same way. I think it's the, the learning curve for some of these video games is also very high. Maybe just a lot more people play video games than chess, but how does it all start? Who does this all start with? So. Well, I mean, okay, so like, yeah, riot, riot pushed it in California. Okay, that makes sense. I mean, I guess that's true too. Like, the the dif difference is, is like you have um you have the uh, developers in a way that you don't have with chess. Like, there is that. Okay. So so I mean, it, it makes yeah, it makes a difference. But but yeah, I mean, I think a lot of it was wasn't it just born out of like these people like just 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 playing it, like just just doing it and coming up with these ideas that you should start well, sure, but... a league. I think a really important thing to think about as well is that these guys don't have any way to play competitively unless it's online. They literally have no other option. We only play over the board chess. There's That's no over true. the board league. That's like, true. That's a good point. So for us, it was always the backup. We've always put a lot more emphasis on over the board, the spectacle, the, mm -hmm. you know, and so for us adjusting to online is totally different. But yeah. Okay, because I mean, I kind of agree, and I feel like a lot of the the fault, maybe not fault, because I don't think it. I mean, I think we're getting there anyway, so it's not a big deal. But I think mm -hmm. probably Fide should have pushed really hard as a governing body, because Fide would be comparable to Riot, I think, right? Like, I know it's a it de it developer; it's a different thing, but I mean, Fide is the governing body. They are the ones who make the ultimate decision, you know, about various things. So I, I think maybe that's that's what matters a lot too. Um, is that like? Yeah, mm -hmm. But how good of I don't think the guys at the top there are like VC guys who understand that if you have a three to five year loss on an investment long term, it might completely change the world. True. You know, like I, That's true. That's a good point. Yeah. It's so very I fair. Think, but this year has completely changed that in chess because we've never had online high stakes tournaments. Mm -hmm. And now we only have online high stakes tournaments. Yeah. So no, that's true. That's true. The difference is that Riot directly gets money from more people playing League in a way that FIDE doesn't from more people playing Chess. This is true. Although, I guess, I mean, people playing Chess, there there are always fees that are paid by the organizers of events. Mm -hmm. So, like, even if they're not getting it directly from the player or the consumer, they are getting it from the 
from like the uh, local federation. I'm but, really scared. Yeah. I'm really scared. Your guy is white. Why are you scared? Actually, why oh. is he Price playing for you? Isn't he a sub of my channel? Why is he playing for you? Oh, uh, no. Well, he's he's. I think he's been a longer sub here. I think he... I've known mm. him for like almost two years, I think, actually. It's been it's been a very long time. He's quite good, actually. He's like he's like a solid fourteen hundred. Yeah. What's his blitz rating here? He's uh twelve twenty two. But yeah, I was just kind of curious because I actually think that Chess should be. I mean, Chess should should be. Wait, how does he only have a piece? Oh, did he lose a piece before the sack? Wait, what? Oh, he didn't take the nut. Oh, he didn't. He, I was looking. I'm like, I thought he was getting two knights for the queen. Next time I'm look, it's like somehow he's got one piece for a queen. Oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah black played so weird this game. I mean, down a yeah. full minute. Yikes. Yikes. But yeah, anyway, I was just curious because I've actually always thought that it's like it's kind of odd because chess was there. I mean, I, I know like now with computer programs, thanks to people like Gary. Oh, Gary um the computer programs are really really good um so you have the issues with like cheating but when i think back there were online tournaments like even 20 years ago there there were online tournaments so Dos it Hermanas? Too wasn't Dos Hermanas online that was online too yes that was right mm -hmm. it's true i feel like this is being under un, un, under uh valued here my team is up four to two we we win we win like the practice sub battle we don't win like the big hype one we win like the impromptu 960 mm -hmm. uh, we, we crush in practice and then we actually yeah. score like eight points in the game yeah 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 well i mean it's yeah this is the practice right they just practice practice but anyway exactly. yeah no i was just i was just kind of curious it just it's it strikes me as very odd when i think back because chess was online there were tournaments there were things going on long before esports was a thing so it's just um it's, it's just it was just interesting it's just interesting to think about i don't think anybody anybody thought about it like these same people who were making the ai for chess to play kasparov or humans mm -hmm. or whatever like did no one have the idea to make chess an online league or was it a thing at, at the top? Like, would the top guys have not found it? True. That's also true. Yeah, like, I mean, I think probably, like, there are people like Anand who really don't like online, I've noticed. Um, I mean, he said that in an interview. So it's like, yeah, I mean, maybe there's that, too. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. F6. D5. Chess had animations that was more colorful to attract more people and viewers. Yeah, I mean, I I, th I just I wonder where like what led what led to all this stuff. Anyways, four two, our guys got a win. We got to focus now. Okay, Black's got a big center. D four is a great move. Black's got a big center though, so I guess White tries to play the center too. Chess elite, chess elitism holds chess back maybe. No, I was just thinking, Levy, because really, like, I remember when I was really young, there were, there were, like, I know the prizes weren't comparable, obviously, but there were online tournaments. There was a lot of stuff online in the early 2000s. So it's just, like, one of those things that it's surprising. Surprising to me. Well, for sure. I remember playing in Dos Hermanas as a kid, like, or, like, the qualifier mm -hmm. or whatever. Right, right, right. No, no, of course. Obviously, I did, too. They'd have two qualifiers every day. Yeah, I, I remember that very, very well. <laughs> Actually, I, th I think there was a game I was I was looking at with like an E6, B6 setup, and it was a game you played in Dos Hermanas against, it might have been Hofhanesian. Like, mm -hmm. again, you just can't escape this guy. You played yeah, him like 15 yeah, years ago Chess. or something. Yep, yep, yeah. yep, totally. <laughs> but, yeah, no, it's, no it's, all, it's all great. It just, it's made me wonder just thinking about it, like why it is, because Chess was around long before these games where it was like just mismanagement. Oh my God, for the love of, oh my... Are you sure? Oh, wait, he caught it. He caught it. It ain't. It, dude. Dude. G6 by Black on the way. Joe, Joe G6 is on the way. $3. Sorry, Warlord, for I have failed lol. Patient. It's okay, Jojo. Just just do better in the, just do better in the, in the real sub battle. That's all. That's all I'm asking. This is just practice. It's all good. No worries. No worries. It's all good. Um, yep. Hikaru's Hikaru benched his starters for practice. He he brought in the uh, <laughs> he brought in the the third string players on minimum contracts, and I'm I'm sending out my big guns here and, and <laughs> <Right>. winning. <laughs> totally, totally. <sighs> yeah.
No, I just say it's, it's just always been something I've wondered about. And actually, that makes me want to read about League more now, just to just to see how it came about. But I mean, maybe, the biggest... maybe the, but you know, I think that's what it is. It's kind of like, the, it's, it's no different than like a startup, right? Probably in chess, they didn't see any problem. They didn't see, like it, with League or with, with these esports, you have, there's no other way you can, you can't have, really have LAN. So it ha- it's all online. It's all through the internet. So mm-hmm. there's a, there's like an actual problem. There's, there's like only one path to success. And like yep. with chess, when you're already having success or you don't see anything wrong with what's going on, it's like um, it's like one of those things where there's no problem, there's there's no issue with the market, so you don't see any reason to do to do anything. Apparently, there's a documentary about esports. Uh, somebody in my chat said mm-hmm. uh, uh, about about how leagues league is the right. biggest esport, right? Yes, yeah. And by the way, to be clear, you guys, I know I know there's land, but what I, I'm saying is like it, if you think about the origins of like any game that's online it's just like a person with a computer connection playing a game so so that's kind of what it is but but anyway um anyway let's 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 watch the game i guess for now so what wait it's on is it on youtube is that what is the history of league no it's called it's called it's on netflix it's called league of legends origins it's a very standard and straightforward oh okay 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 i'll definitely i'll watch that later then yeah Oh, StarCraft is... Yes, the... actually, StarCraft I am familiar with, to be fair. I, I, I vaguely recall StarCraft from the old days. I remember watching, like, Slayers and all those guys playing the tournaments. So, yeah, a little bit different, but... That is a not... That is a weird move. It's a move, good move, but... though. It's a good move. He had a lot of wins. He chose the slowest path. Yeah, but it's still winning. Yeah, anyway, no, I was, I was just curious because it seems odd to me that for chess, like you had online sites. I mean, chess, I feel like I feel like chess was on, on the internet before even like StarCraft or anything. I think like Internet Chess Club was like 92 maybe or 93. I mean, it was ages ago, but but yeah, I was just wondering what your thoughts were. Oh, yeah, those totally. Um, I, I, I don't know too much about the origins of this of, of esports and like i have maybe a few hours every day to watch something so i'll just watch mm-hmm. whatever and he car is molding 92 93 <laughs> i'm old you guys anyway congrats levy you won congrats we'll still watch the last game anyway but congrats on a win of course um a win against my backups my reserve <laughs> enjoy it it's like the, the, this is the only way you're ever gonna win I feel bad for the uh, eight representatives of, <laughs> of Team Hikaru who are like, wait, what? I thought this was like so serious. <laughs> it's all good though. This is 960 too. Like, I don't know, 960, I, I feel like certain people are actually just much better at probably in these rating ranges than other people. But anyway, yeah. yeah that's... Is your guy just not even in... Twitch Life just chess? he is. I was able to follow him. Oh. I think he is. What a username. That is... Belliged donated $5. That is weird. Jojo, we both lost the battle. But the war is not over yet. Let's win next time. Yeah, Sanj. true. True. Indeed, indeed. Thank you for the dono, Bill Egg TT. Appreciate it. Um... You still waiting on the last guy? My guy's definitely in live chat. Live chat. Yeah, yeah. My, my, my guy's there. My guy's there. Sag daddy. Yeah. The Sag daddy, you said? Sag daddy. Oh. Oh my. Oh my God. That's even worse. Okay. Oh my God. Is, okay. is it, I think. I think it's okay. Yeah. Oh my God. Okay. Um. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's keep watching. Okay. okay here we go. Game time. <laughs> All right. Okay, pretty normal so far. Um, ooh, b6 I don't love, but bishop b7 maybe is a move. Probably e5, playing the center. Yeah, I like this. Wow. Yeah, the guy was writing in my chat. He was like, I'm, I'm nervous. Uh, Going to try to rep Team Gotham. I'm like, dude, it's not that serious. Like, it's not the Hunger Games, you know? Mm-hmm. True, true. We support you, but... No need to stress. Indeed, indeed. Pretty normal so far, though, right? Like e5, maybe. I mean, I think black's a little bit better here, right? Maybe. Maybe not. I think space advantage is good at this level. Mm-hmm. I think a lot more space here, yeah, because black's going to 
play some moves and potentially do something crazy. Uh, someone says chess had to be organized through grassroots with no developer backing. That's the main reason fighting games also had a hard time breaking into esports as well. Aha, uh -huh. okay, that, that makes some sense. That makes that actually makes some sense in, in general terms. Why is white thinking for like 30 seconds though, dude? Come on, let's go. Let's move. It's not easy, Levy. It's hard. Okay, some analysis here. Mm hmm. The deep tank. Oh, did he spell out Queen? <laughs> it's a move. It's a move. I actually like EH5. I think it's pretty reasonable. No developer backing because the devs are long dead. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good one that's a good one <laughs> um yeah let's see okay knight and... g2 pretty normal can white castle here he could right he could go Boop. oh my god it's not good this is not you guys can't tilt Hikaru before his games, man. Like, nah, it's all good. It's all good. I'm just confused. This is weird. This is weird. Um, I'm not gonna lie. Just a weird day. Well, like I said, it's all practice. It's practice for the real events, so it's it's all good. But what happens if in the real event this spoils the? Uh the camaraderie and then like the subs start losing what's gonna happen oh no my subs won't lose they're 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 really good at 960 or uh regular chess. okay <laughs> yeah yeah oh, wow. i don't think i spoke to you about this so i'm just gonna <laughs> publicly speak to you about it um so I, I tweeted after pod champs ended and i was like you know if any any creators like want to get together and do some chess do something mm -hmm. else like let me know so a guy who's a YouTube animator. They do these cartoons that they voice yeah. over named, named uh, Tim Tom. Mm -hmm. He he wants to do a chess lesson at some point and he wants to do a an animated cartoon of the chess boom. Oh, wow. Cool. And maybe you and I will do some voice acting there. So that's my invitation. I mean, we're, we're going to get paid for the voice acting. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Um, but as your uh, de facto agent on this matter, uh, we'll be taking an eighty percent cut. So <laughs> <laughs> hope that's fair. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> no, but it, it's actually the, those YouTube cartoons with voice, like with voiceovers, mm -hmm. are so popular. Those. Like, oh, I know, I know. Yeah, ones, they're crazy popular. This guy gets like millions of views on every video so it's pretty it's pretty cool mm -hmm. we'll pay you an exposure hikaru hope that's right. okay <laughs> supporting small content creators yes for the love of chess guys pog pago right exactly <laughs> um yeah exactly <laughs> yeah no that's actually really cool though yeah that, that would be a that'd be a lot of fun because no one, no, no one's quite done that there there was the who was the channel the like one of the first things that you reviewed the guy like there's YouTubers who make like, they, they latch onto the growth of a category and then they show like the history and how it's growing. Um, You're saying you, there's you, an anime? No, no, no. You you re you did like a like a video where you watched a video of a guy talking about XQC, the boom, you. Uh, but that wasn't anime, was it? Or was no, it? no, 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 no. Oh, you it just mean a regular? Just... Oh, just regular. Okay, yeah. yeah. That, that wasn't that wasn't that wasn't Charlie. No, or no it was it esports. Maybe it was esports. It was esports, I think. It had to have been the esports score then, for sure. Esports score, or 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 yeah, I think it was the esports score. It, it was, it was the esports score. Oh, whoa! Your guy just hung a bishop. Oh, yo yo. He hung a lot more than a bishop. Maybe depends. Oh my! <laughs> or that. <laughs> but it's okay. Now it doesn't matter because you're winning. Yeah. Yo, what this man just? He might, he might still win. He I like believe win somehow. Time. Yeah, I mean, this king is really. Or, or mate somehow. I oh my yeah, God. I think he's gonna get checkmated. Queen e four? No, queen c two. Oh, sorry, I shouldn't have said that. But that's actually. Ooh, he could have blundered rook a six, rook c six mate if he hadn't been careful. It's actually he might, little... he might still blunder. Oh, that's a free rook, by the way. But anyway. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God, is he actually gonna? <gasps> wow, that's sad. 
Oh, wow. Dude. Yeah. Oh, that's no, 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 no. Yeah, that's uh, that is pretty sad. Yikes is right. Wow. Yo, Sag Daddy yeah. clushing it out. This was wow. That was wow, close. guys. Close. <sighs> okay. Enough, well, man. uh. I, I don't know what to say. I feel like that is the highest it will ever get for us and we'll never win again. So <laughs> congrats, Maybe. guys. You we'll did see. it. We'll see. We'll see. But yeah, that, that was pretty pretty amazing. That, that was kind of impressive the way that your guys won. Somehow every single game today it felt like. Yeah, like it was literally like, every single one. That's what I'm saying. I think like they showed up to play and 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 the, the B team, the tryout team showed up to the Hikaru channel to play and, and that was... Uh... But I think when, when the... Uh main team comes back it's gonna be it's gonna be difficult eh, yeah well at least you got a victory somewhere right that is true that is true yeah uh 